A University of Houston math professor says he is just fed up with his students' sloppy emails. So he's adding email etiquette to his teaching curriculum. Here are some of his tips. In my dealings with students over the past decade, I have noticed that a lot of emails that I get are not written in a professional manner. When I see a short one-line email that looks more like a text than it does a message you would send to your professor, my initial thought is that the student doesn't understand the norms of professional interaction. When sending an email, it's important to include a subject line because when a professor gets a bunch of email, they like to scan the subject lines and have an idea of what the content of the message is. In some of the emails that I've received, there hasn't been an address, or at the beginning of the email, they'll just say, hey, or hey, prof, abbreviating the title, or worse yet, address a professor that they don't know by their first name. And so a good way to start an email is to say, hello, professor so-and-so. It's also important that students sign the email with their name, and especially if it's a student that I don't know very well if they use their full name. Spelling and grammar tend to be a problem, and while most email applications have a spell check feature, it's still true that students have to be careful when they're writing. And so a lot of students are very receptive, and once they find out what the expectations are, they're more than happy to rise to meet those expectations. <laughs> oh, all good advice, yeah, right? Really. Very good tips. The professor also suggests students get rid of those emails they created during their teenage years. You know, yes. the, the silly ones, the, you know, like Hottie94 was one that they mentioned <laughs> at Yahoo. You know, um, get funny. something more professional that includes your name. It's you funny can. you say that because both of my daughters as teenagers have already changed their email addresses as yes, they've grown up. Right. right. And they don't text like they used to. Now they're a little more professional. It's just amazing good. how they do finally morph into being human beings. Hey, how do you Love consult that. somebody that's a stickler on grammar? There, there, there. That's how you do it, all That's three spellings. Right. All right. I'm trying to teach my teenagers Good. the same thing. Talk to your friends one way, talk to us adults a different way. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's be a little, little more. All right, we know 